Hello, welcome to another Writerly Witterings, and today I'm in a privileged position because I thought it would be fun to show an unboxing what's in here. Some of you, a little while ago, will have seen the video in which I reviewed some paper from William Hanna Limited. I was deeply impressed with the packaging and the way it was all presented. It was lovely. And then when I started writing on it, it was just gorgeous. And I had a couple of conversations with those nice people at William Hanna, and the result was this. Now today is Christmas Eve, and I spoke to William Hanna late last week, and in fact on Friday, they said, we'd like you to have a look at one of our notebooks. And I thought, that's jolly nice, sometime in the new year I'll get a notebook. But no, it arrived on Christmas Eve. So it seems only fair to look at this in the light of the fact that they managed to get it to me so quickly. First of all, this packaging is just lovely. Really nicely presented. It's actually superb, it really is very, very nice indeed. Got a nice textured surface. But that's just a box. First of all, let's have a look in here. This is how William Hanna sell their paper. Which I think is very nice. So if you order some paper, you get inserts that go with it. Oh, you get a little William Hanna notebook. That's rather nice. A welcome so about the company caring for the notebook what to do with it because putting pen to paper helps us to organize our thoughts remember our notes and bring our dreams and ideas a step closer to reality can't disagree with that at all so begin a new write anything journal daily good do good things journal start a bucket list write a short story doodle well short story is definitely a good one I like that that's nice then there's a card which has various examples of writing and I must admit so far the organization has demonstrated extremely good handwriting because all the communications I've had or most of them have been on paper very nice we believe writing helps to create a perfect writing experience do we do we do beautiful notes for the left and your rings right that's good and then got some inserts these look nice what is there Oh, right, OK. So we've got a weekly review. Notes, lined paper, dot grid, squared off and plain. Lots of different types of paper. So that's all very well. Where are we going to put this paper? <coughs> Let's find out. So here we have a William Hanna notebook. That is gorgeous. I'm sorry, this is going to have to go the the smell test. It smells beautiful. Now this, I believe, you can see here there's a WH logo and on the inside is a little screw. You can unscrew that and then you can attach various things such as, I believe, pen loops and similar devices. So what we've got here is a notebook full of brilliant paper and a diary, that's very handy, a calendar rather. Now what's good about these things is they are like Atoma notebooks. You can rip pages out, change the order of them and put them back in again. That is phenomenally useful. But... <clears throat> Let me grab my current Atoma. This is an Atoma notebook. Now, the problem it has is that when you're holding it up, it's very flexible. As you can see, it flexes lots. These are all individual metal rings that can rotate. And that's nice because it means you can open the notepad completely. You can take paper out, put it back in again, do whatever you want, in exactly the same way as you can with the William Hanna. The William Hanna 
will not bend back all the way round, so it has to be laid flat. But you can see down here that there's a metal bar running through each of these steel rings. The ends of the metal bar go into little leather pockets. So you can see one leather pocket here. <coughs> and it goes through a little loop of leather in the middle and then it ends up in another leather pocket at the top. So that means that the rings are pretty much inflexible because the metal bar holds them in place. It makes it a much more easy to write in environment. And I must admit, I think that this blue and gorgeous honey coloured outside is just magnificent. Beautifully stitched all the way around with the William Hanna logo at the bottom there. Basically, what is not to like? That is beautiful, absolutely perfect. So, to David Round of William Hanna, what more can I say other than thank you very much indeed. That is a gorgeous notepad and I'm looking forward to testing this and then giving a report on it later. So there we have it, a lovely notebook. I'm going to be using that quite a lot in future, but today, being Christmas Eve, I've just done in a 10 minute break between peeling carrots, peeling and cutting up a swede, two branches of sprouts, potatoes, some celery and onion and garlic and other stuff to go into the stock for the gravy. Basically I've been very busy today. This is Christmas Eve. I hope by the time you see this you will have had a wonderful Christmas. I will have done, I'm sure of it. So for now, thanks a lot for watching. If you want to join the Patreon, go down the bottom, there's a link to, the to my Patreon site. If you want to make a comment, subscribe, and if you do subscribe, hit the bell button, then you get notified when a new video comes out. Like it and share it and all those good things. And apart from that, I'm going to go away and find a glass of wine now, because I think I deserve it. Take care. <laughs> Happy New Year, folks. Cheers.